So here's an, here's the best way to get it back on because you it might not actually be broken, but something just might not be connecting around here. So what you want to do is get your space bar off, take off those little rails, and then what happens is you put these rails back on, but they have to clip under those tiny little feet. But on mine, this is one of my broken ones, that little foot is actually broken. So double check that those aren't broken on yours and they're standing upright because they're quite bendy. So then you want to get one rail, put it at the top, and then just push it up it's just so it tucks underneath those little teeth. Get your second rail, tuck it under there. It's a bit fiddly, but as long as they're tucked under those teeth on both sides, then it should be fine. Like I said, mine's broke, so it's not actually going to work properly. Then you get your space bar, and then see you've got those one, two, three, four on both sides. These go towards the top, and then these go towards the bottom, and they clip onto these little scissor mechanisms here. So then if you've got your two wide ones at the top, turn it over, and then the top go clicks in first, and then the bottom clicks in. So let's say we've got all our things aligned. You put the top side in first. So you start to click in. There we go. And then you kind of run your fingers along the bottom. Actually, yeah, there we go. Even though my te the tooth on this side is broken, it's working fine. So double check all those bits are right. If one of your teeth is broken or your scissor mechanism is broken, then um, you would need a new space bar, but I include both the scissor mechs, the, the metal bar and the space bar, which is all you need. The little button in the middle, which is these, um, they don't really come off and you can't replace them. I've tried to take them off before, but it doesn't really work. Um, so yeah, let us know how you get on.